spoiler warning, if you haven't read the Throne of Glass series and the Actar series by Sarah J. Mass, save this and come back later when you're done. I am pretty confident I have found more evidence that Maeve from the Throne of Glass series was in Perithian, specifically in the Night Court. So I just finished my Era Fire reread the other day, and I in particular noticed the description of Maeve's palace in Doranel and how similar it was to the palace of the night court atop of the mountain. They are described almost the exact same way. Let me show you. Chapter 59, Air of Fire, Aelin and Rowan have arrived in Doranel and specifically at Maeve's palace. And it says they were escorted through a shining palace of pale stone and sky blue gossamer curtains. The floor a mosaic of delicate tiles depicting various scenes from dancing maidens to pastorals to the night sky. And then it goes on to say that the pools were freckled with night blooming lilies. Jasmine wove around the massive columns and lights of colored glass hung from the arched ceilings. Enough of the palace was open to the elements to suggest the weather here was always this mild. It then goes on to say that Maeve's stronghold had been built from stone. So much stone, all of it pale and carved and polished and gleaming. In chapter five of Akamath, Feyre gets introduced to the night court and seeing the palace for the first time. And some of the first things she says is that I smelled a jasmine first, then saw stars, a sea of stars flickering beyond glowing pillars of moonstone that framed the sweeping view of the endless snow-capped mountains. Welcome to the night court. It then goes on to say whatever building we were in had been perched atop one of the gray stone mountains. The hall around us was open to the elements, no windows to be found, just towering pillars and gossamer curtains, swaying in that jasmine-scented breeze. A little further down, we end up seeing where it says, a few balls of light bobbed on the breeze, along with colored glass lanterns dangling from the arches of the ceiling. These palaces are both so similar. They're both made of stone. You've got gossamer curtains. They're open to the elements and you've got jasmine or the scent of jasmine and even the arched ceilings or colored lanterns or colored lights. So I'm now convinced that the Night Court Palace in Perithian was Maeve's palace at one point in time. 